Thank you so much for joining me for another episode of Technology Tip Thursday. If you have not already, please like, share, and subscribe. In this video, I'm going to show you Power BI's new update of Power BI visual calculations and how to quickly do that. And this one, I'm actually going to show you which one I like better. Is it Tableau table calculations or Power BI visual calculations? So let's go ahead and hop into the video. So now I'm in Tableau. I'm going to show you what a table calculation is. A table calculation is a really, really quick way to create a calculation at a Tableau review. So and here I just have two examples. I have a sum of sales where I'm just using the default measure of sum of sales. And then I created a calculation of total sales, which is doing a sum of sales. You see the values are the same, but I just want to show you visually what a table calculation is doing. Um, if we go into our table calcs, you see there's a drop down arrow here that you can click on. And then once you click on that, you'll see an option for either add table calculation or quick table calculation. So if you look at the quick table calculations, you can see within a couple clicks of a button, there's a running total, a difference, percent and difference, percent of total, rank, percentile, and a moving average. So in a couple clicks of buttons, I'm able to do these calculations really, really fast. In this example, what I'm gonna do is just do a running total just to show you what it's doing. And a running total is means I'm just summing up the information and creating a running total. So if I hit this drop down arrow, create quick calculation, select running total. We'll see now that my running total is going down because you're seeing that it's going by default table down and it's just summing up the information together and I'm doing a running total. So this is a table calculation in Tableau. Again, a couple click of a buttons to be able to generate this. You don't know, you don't have to know the code. Tableau automatically does it for you. I think it's really, really awesome. So what we're going to do now in Power BI, we're going to look at the new calculation feature that just came out, the visual calculation feature that just came out. So by default, if you've upgraded and updated your preview feature. You got to go and make sure that you set the new preview feature. You see there's an option that says new calculation. And what this does is you can create a calculation on the visual itself. So what I've done is I've selected my table. Now when I come to new calculation, you see a new window pop up at the bottom where it says calculation. So this is not stored in your data model. Um, it is truly created on the visual itself. So if I want to call this running total, equals run in sum and we're going to call this sum of sales so one big difference here is that it is referencing the name of your visual or your measure that is in your visual so by default this is called sum of sales in my visual but it's not called sum of sales in my data model so make sure that you understand exactly what you have your stuff named at in your naming convention um, that way you're going to reference that calculation so now that i have that created i will hit ok and then now we see we have our running total. If I go back, we see now that we have done the exact same running total, sum of sales, running total. And then we have that information specifically in the visual itself. We go to our data model. We don't see anything in our data model that shows the information. Um, we only see the running total in the visual itself. So this is how you can do visual calculations on the table itself. So my personal preference in all of this is Tableau's table calcs. Um, Super easy to do in a couple clicks of a button to generate this. I believe you save time, you save a lot of energy. Um, and even if you just want to clear it out, you can right click the drop down arrow and select clear table calc and then it goes away. So to me, table calculations are a really great feature in Tableau. I think it's one of the better features that they have over Power BI. Power BI's visual calc is a good start, it's really cool, but there is a level of DAX that you need to know. If you don't know DAX, you're going to struggle. So you don't know the calculations you're looking for there's a bunch of different calculations out there there's offset there's all this new stuff that's coming on if that's not your cup of tea um there might be a bit of a learning curve there so for my preference i believe table calculations are better in tableau over the new calculation if there becomes more of a ux ui type of feel to where i can do a couple clicks of a button and do some of my automatic calculations easily then it might come up to par with tableau but for right now i'm gonna stick with tableau on this feature um, and maybe leverage new calculations where I need it. We'll see. We'll see what I do. We'll see what the clients need, but we'll see. Um, but that's all I have in this video. Please like, share, and subscribe. Hit me up in the comments. Let me know. Are you using this new feature in Power BI? Have you started tinkering with it? Do you love table calculations in Tableau? Let me know. Hit me up in the comments. Everybody have a great day, and we'll talk to you all next Technology Tip Thursday.